Hey guys, welcome back to a new Let's Play of Super Mario Galaxy. Originally, this was actually one of the chosen ones of the beginning Let's Plays, but I ended up cho uh, choosing Okami. This, on the other hand, was actually a legitimate qu request way back, but I was like, nah. But I shall continue it since I have finished. I mean, well, by the time this video will be up, the two Let's Plays I've already completed shall be up. Or well, hopefully up. And then we can at least start and... and whatever. So, let us begin. Probably by the mic you'll hear noises. Oh, and I need to move my pointer. And my pointer. My pointer! Above the Mushroom Kingdom. Aw, that's cute. The comet was was so large one year, it filled the skies and sent countless shooting stars raining down. Mm. Excuse me. <laughs> Sorry, I got a stuffy nose. I might go uh get something real quick. The toads brought the stars to the castle, where they became a great power star. Aw, that's cool. It should have been a very happy time for the citizens of Mushroom Kingdom. <laughs> that was the night of the Star Festival, held once every hundred years to celebrate the comet. <laughs> Sorry. I got a loogie. I 
got Louis up my nose. Just kidding. I got the blues. Hey, Mario. I'll be waiting for you at the castle uh, on the night of the Star Festival. There's something I'd like uh, to give you. From me. Bitch, it better be. Okay. I swear. If this girl just gives me something like a cake like in Mario 64, I'm slapping her. I'm sorry, but if she just gives me a stupid cake, I'm gonna slap her. It may count like abuse, but I don't get it. Let me actually be legitimately serious with you guys. This, this set of Mario that they have in this game... Uh, damn it, I can't do the timing. Damn it, okay, one, two, three... Four. Cool, yeah, there we go. Uh, ah, damn it, they don't have the little spin of it. I'll guess it's party time. Eh. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. I still have the ability to shoot off little star pieces, but the partner is also able to do that, but they won't be playing as any of the characters. Give me Mario! Welcome to the Mushroom Kingdom! Hey, hey, no. Give me that. Give it that. Drop that. Drop that. Sir? Drop the uh, star piece. Sir? Give me that. Hey, Mario! See this? I, I mean, you see that weird random star shape? I have. Grab as many of them as you can. Okay. Does... Ah, son of a chocobo! Oh! I need to remember that timing with that. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Eh, eh. Oh, let me actually do, uh... I'm being distracted so much, um... Let me actually explain the, uh... The controller itself, for those that have not played this... Like, played this game so far. Oh, well, have yet to play this game. And for those that haven't, eh... You are kind of missing out on a good game. It's just... Okay, it's kind of given of a Mario game. Where it's an adventure game. Not the art like the Mario RPG style. Or the 64. But, uh... Let me actually interrupt that. I'm interrupting myself to add in more details to it. Um... Something that kind of bothered me is the... The more, the more lighter color Mario this one has. It seems a little strange. That uh, this Mario seems to be, you know, more flexible in a way. But then later on in other games, like, uh, the... Yeah. I can't even slide down the hill, this is just torment. Uh, I mean, uh... Two, three, ah, damn it. Okay, I need focus. I'm screwing around too much. But, uh... <clears throat> the graphics seem to at least be really high, but then later on it doesn't seem to at least affect it. It doesn't really change after this, though, so that kind of seems weird. But anyways, let me ex actually explain the, the stupid uh, game mechanics. I mean, the uh, supposed controls. With the, uh, with the pointer of the Wiimote aimed at the screen, you will be able to at least shoot out the little star pieces you collect. The Honestly, they do not damage the enemy, but it does do a temporary stun on them. You can shoot other people like that. <laughs> there is also another, like... That is kind of... That is going... The little ability I just showed you right now will be a... A slight important thing to come in the, in the game. One, two, three. One... One, two, three, uh, one, two, three. Okay, so anyways, with Mario, he's given at least his normal jumps. Back jump, three times jump so that he'll be able to jump, uh, jump really high. Um, I don't know if he has his, gr oh yeah, 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 he has his ground pound, so it allows him to be able to be pounding you like a hurricane. Um, well, actually, let me explain a little further. And that, the, 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 B, the, the back B trigger is going to be the, the ability to shoot at star pieces. The A on the Wiimote is, uh, 
basically Mario to be able to jump. And as you know, most Mario games, it will be helpful. Uh, the, the Z button on the nunchuck that you'll have to at least use, because to play this game, it involves the Wii Mote and the nunchuck. Ugh, excuse me. It's kind of slightly, like, it's kind of important for Mario to at least be able to, uh, move around, because the nunchuck uses, I mean, has a little analog stick, uh, to at least be able to move your thumb freely. Evening to you! Oh no! Oh, come on, that's messed up. They were having all the chillax party, bringing in the margaritas, bringing out the hoes, bringing out the marijuana you want. You are gonna just go and destroy you. What is that? They're not even connected to the boats. So they're just like connected to nothing. Oh no! Wow, that's messed up. Question: Why in the world does why is Bowser able to do that now? Especially with Cammy, whenever he never did this before. That's my question. That's kind of stupid. Actually, uh, let me think. It wasn't Mario 64, but Mario, uh, Bowser. Bowser. What the hell? She's never carried that thing before. Coming into first contact. Oh no! It's Bowser! Again. What is new about... Princess! You are formally invited to, cre to the creation of the Are you seriously? Guys, you're supposed to be like National Guards or something. This festival's over! Drop him out of God of And UFOs! Not fun. Princess Peach, yeah! Eh. Yeah. Nope, doesn't do a damn thing. Oh no! Oh no, Princess is in trouble! Yeah. 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 There we go! Oh! I wonder what if I go this way. Hurry to the princess. Well, aren't you guys supposed to be the guard? Okay. That's kind of pathetic that they had to at least rely on Mario every single time. Seriously, why isn't there one toe that's able to at least fight Bowser? Help me! You know what? Screw you, bitch. I've always had to protect your dumbass. I want to at least go to the the ship. Hey, hey. Let me grab the chain in the back. Let me grab the chain in the back. Yeah. Cause if I could grab the chain, I could just infiltrate that without worrying about doing a stupid cutscene. Yeah. Uh, but guess what? And I gotta go near the cutscene. I couldn't just grab onto the boat, which seems way more convenient than just me. Look at that boat. All those little tiny invisible pieces that you can see on the screen. What the fuck, monkey? Seriously, lasers? That high tech? Come on now, Gooby please. And he cuts a hole in the ground. Okay. And look at the toads. They're not doing it. Diddly squat. I'm pretty amazed that Bowser is able. Uh, Bowser is able to construct such things. He's smart enough to at least do this. He's smart enough to at least create a flying ship. He is not smart enough to outsmart a plumber. I I'm just I'm just throwing that out there. That's kind of bothering me. There, there's so many things wrong with that whenever you're, he's able to have all of this established by kidnapping the princess like so many times. Or maybe Princess Peach just stopped caring and then she's like, eh, take me. I don't care. Mario's gonna whoop your butt. Or some kind of little uh, turn on. I don't know. It just it, it's kind of weird like that. Oh. 
And I don't know how, Mario seems already out of energy. <laughs> so long, enjoy your flight! Sounds so derpy. And then Cammy's like, Eat my Kamehameha! Even though Mario didn't seem like... Why did Mario seem even out of energy anyways to begin with, and he was knocked out of the atmosphere? That is messed up, sir. So.